All right, here's my basement shop. A couple of tools I've picked up over the years. This is my number 15 Buffalo drill press. Uh, this is one of the first things I picked up uh, on Craigslist. Got it for about 100 bucks, not a bad deal. Did a total uh, breakdown on it, but uh, still got the original paint, original finish. The motor that came with it, uh, quarter horsepower, works out real nice. Here we got my Walker Turner driveline grinder with a wire wheel. Does a lot of work on restoring equipment, getting things sharp. All right, over here we have my 1941 Delta Milwaukee bandsaw, cast iron base. Picked that up from a uh, iron scrapper. Did a real good job of restoring that one. Uh, runs real nice, half horsepower. This is the uh, Craftsman Badge Parks Planer. Cuts a real nice line. And got the new blades ready to install. Got to get uh, my dial out and get those all dialed in. Here's my 1950s DeWalt radial arm saw, dedicated for just right angle cuts. Right next to it, uh, got a little piece of modern equipment there. All right, here's the uh, six inch cast iron base. Works out really nice, makes a nice smooth cut. Just got the blades installed on that one. And here's the Walker Turner cabinet saw, Cutler Hammer starters. Got a uh, one horsepower 220. Uh, putting that one on Craigslist because I got this guy over here. This is my 1944 Unisaw. A fellow old woodworker sold me his uh, goose egg. It was very nice of him. Completed that one up. Runs uh, runs like it's brand new. And last but not least, we've got the Delta Crescent 8 inch. That's got a uh, one horsepower wired for 220. Did a total restore on that one. Only major issue is had a few incidents there in the past at some point, but still runs and works wonderfully and cuts a nice smooth line.